Hey guys, Uncle Ray. Welcome to another episode of the Crypto Bellwether. On this channel, we cut through the hype and the noise, and I give you the non-biased information you can use to hopefully capitalize on the biggest opportunity in history, and that's this bull run. Now, I have some bags stacked from the bear market, the utility tokens like Quant and Link and HBAR. They're going to do well, but I believe that AI and gaming and gamify and maybe even some meme coins are going to lead this bull run. And I'm here for the money. So I've been doing a lot of deep dives and it led me to these three games for sure. Now I'm going to tell you about them and I believe they belong in everyone's portfolio it's just a matter of how much do you want to allocate now none of this is financial advice and i just want to bring them to your attention don't go fomo in do your research and decide if they're right for you but i believe that these projects are absolute no-brainers so go ahead and hit that like button and let me tell you why i say that now the first project is Nakamoto Games. Go to nakamoto.games, surf around. Now, I don't really care about the project. I really don't. It may be all world or maybe it's not. But what I care about is the hype and the buzz and the people involved in Nakamoto Games. Now, maybe you heard, but there's a group that was created by Alex Becker and Elliot. I'm not sure what Elliot's last name is, but they're the who's who of crypto. And they brought all the founders, literally from my understanding, like 90% of the founders of all the Web3 gaming projects in crypto into Nakamoto Games. And they built this insider network and they have a launch pad. And they're going to be launching all these projects as a group. And unfortunately, to be a part of that launch pad, you got to buy the NFTs that go with that. And they start at like $20,000. So that closes the doors for most people. That being said, one way we can get a piece of that pie is by buying Nakamoto Games and it's under the Bytes icon. So go take a look at that. Do some research on Alex Becker and Elliot. And Elliot has a YouTube channel, uh, Ilio Trades. Guys, they are two people you want to follow if you're in gaming. Take a look at that project. Now, Superverse. Probably going to end up being one of my biggest gaming bags it used to be super farm now it's merged into super verse now guess what that group of insiders that was founded by alex becker well his partner was elliot and elliot this is elliot's baby now i was watching a podcast and i've created a video on this where elliot was talking about all those founders now think about this guys this is just common sense. To me, it's literally a no-brainer. He was talking about all these insiders, all these founders, all these owners of the Web3 Gaming were saying, hey, we need this certain infrastructure. He didn't mention what that is, but that's what he created with Superverse. And even Super Farm, if you go back and look at the chart, it did immensely well. It pumped hard hard in the last bull run well now it's new and improved it's switched gears it's going in a whole different area and it's made up to service the who's who of gaming this is the biggest no-brainer i've ever seen for me i'm stacking bags and i'm also just put on a swing trade do your research, not financial advice, but I think you'll end up in the same place as me. Now, I know there's a lot of craziness about Gala Games. 
But hear me out. You know, I tell people all the time, you don't have to listen to me. Listen to the people I listen to. If I do have a superpower, it's to know who to listen to. You don't follow the dumb money. You follow the smart money. You follow the people that are insiders if you can have access to them. Well, I was watching a podcast uh, from Elliot, who is the founder of the group of in Nakamoto Games and Superverse, and he was talking about all the new projects and the hype of gaming, how it's going to explode and it's all going to do well. And he talked about Superverse and he said, look, it's a big announcement and it's going to be a, have a big impact of crypto gaming. He didn't say what it was. But he also talked about Gala Games. And this was, by, by the way, a podcast by uh, Crypto Banter with Elliot. And it, when he talked about, he asked him, what do you think about Gala Games? Now, we all know that there's a lawsuit among the founders and all that. And it is a big number. It's like $30 million. But that's only a big number to us. I can promise you it's not that big a number among the project of Gala Games. And they are not going to kill off the money printer of Gala Games. I mean, The Rock is a partner. Snoop Dogg. You got Gala Games, Gala Music, uh, what is it, Gala Films. This is a all-world project. And here's what Elliot said, and I didn't really think about it, but I want to, to bring it to your attention. And when you do think about it, it makes sense. He said, what separates some of the projects or all of the projects in gaming than all of the rest of crypto is that, you know, when you build a DeFi platform or a lot of different platforms, you know, you take a group of badass developers and a chunk of money and you can create that in three months, six months easily. And you can compete with the best in the world. You can't just throw money at gaming. No matter what, it takes, you know, two, three, four, five, ten years to build out a game and definitely the infrastructure. And he said that's where Gala Games is going to win. And he expects it to have a huge upside because it has like ten years of building out that infrastructure. It's not something you do overnight. Now, you can have competitors that, you know, jump in there and get some market share, but they can't get to the level of Gala Games in a year or two. They just can't do it. So he expects Gala Games to onboard a lot of great projects and have a lot of good games and to do extremely well. And I tend to agree. Whatever the issues are among the founders, you got to think, guys, $30 million or whatever it is, is a lot of money. But they can settle that because they got, you know, 10x or 1,000x more money waiting for them when, you know, they get back to the real business of gaming with Gala Games. That's just my thought process. Anyway, guys, I wanted to bring those to your attention. I know it's the holidays and, and, and we're starting a new year. It's time to get a game plan. Hopefully you have a game plan because it is go time. Now, I do one-on-one -on -one coaching. It's $250 for three calls, whether it's phone calls or uh, Zoom calls. We get into your mindset, dollar cost averaging, how to compare projects to another and we look at your portfolio and we talk about how what your risk reward is it's not financial advice it's coaching of how to get a game plan and if you have an interest it's 250 dollars i'll leave a link down below now that being said whether you want to do coaching for me i highly recommend guys get a plan and take profits or you'll become the profits. I can't say that enough. You know, when you FOMO into a project and you hold too long, you end up being the exit liquidity 
for the smart money. I say that with love, but I don't want you to get wrecked. I don't want you to watch your portfolio, do a 10x, 15x, hopefully a 20x, and then watch it go all the way back down. And that is the number one thing that people come to me for coaching. They've turned a small amount of money into a large amount of money during a bull run, and they have nothing to show for it. Don't let that happen to you. Anyway, guys, that's all I got. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Tell me what you think about these three projects, but I think they're absolute no-brainers. Take care, guys. Hit that like button and come back and be part of this community. Take care.